Good evening, guys. Good evening, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? How's everybody doing? A little sad. Why? Why are you sad? Tomorrow is the last time. No, you gotta be happy. <laughs> so instead of feeling sad, you should uh, feel happy because that means that you are moving forward, that you are ready for it intermediate number three right and just start a new module so i guess it's something to be happy about <laughs> come on but we will miss you teacher oh no worries i'm going to be like bothering you around <laughs> okay so hi guys i see Belen here gabby ruben good evening guys so thank you so much for joining it's really really nice to see you how was your weekend did you have a good weekend Did you have a good Saturday? Do you have a good Sunday? Um, good evening. In my case, no. <laughs> Why not? What happened? Um, since Friday, I've been with flu and allergies. Oh. So, uh, yeah, I'm still with with allergies on my eyes. I like a uh, inflama inflamados. Oh, they're like <laughs> swollen, yeah. like itchy. Yeah, a little bit, oh, and I'm tried sorry. and 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 uh -huh. everything that I'm just. Well, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Hi, good evening. Yeah. Um, I'm really sorry to hear that, but I hope you get over soon. But so, have you been home or have you been going out? No, just at home since Friday because I haven't been feeling uh, great to be outside just uh, in my bed with uh, my pillow and and listening to my movies because I can't keep my ass eyes open for longer oh yeah i totally get that and a lot of liquids i imagine so <laughs> yeah yeah so well i hope uh, it's nothing serious it's just a flu or allergies but but anyways take care of yourself so hopefully you'll get over it super soon um the, well that sounds bad hi guys how are you doing hi arnaldo ricardo thank you for joining uh, good, good evening, evening. hello good evening guys judy um i see also we got helen hello angelica how you doing angelica hello, Just on the horse hi good evening how you doing let me see who else is here well guys uh thank you so much for joining thank you uh for the um spending your two hours uh with us right uh, and yes guys terminamos moglo el día de mañana so we are finishing intermediate number two tomorrow please no se les olvide uh, you know acompañarnos do not miss tomorrow's class porque igual debemos de completar la encuesta de de, de finalización right que es eh, como la finalización del compromiso we got within so far and tenemos también, you know, la foto de Sierra de Molo, guys, so please do not miss that one. Uh, today, todavía tenemos eh, un par de, de topics to clear out. Um, we have been checking reasons, eh, hazards. Eh, so today vamos a revisar un poquito de eso. And especially un poquito de natural disasters. Um, and uh, sabemos que es super important, especially because vivimos en un país bien vulnerable, right? So we're going to talk a little bit about that. And guys, no se han asustado con los temblores. No los han sentido o no han salido corriendo. Or, uh, uh, do you feel scared whenever there's More that I like it, teacher. You like them? No, more that I like. More oh, that I prefer. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> But si los has sentido, are yeah. you aware of, oh, really? Okay. Wow, yo no he sentido ninguna, you know. <laughs> but, but yeah, uh, I remember in the previous class, Francisco mencionaba eso, que en la zona donde vivía, al igual que Rafa, um, so eran como más um, fáciles, eran uh, uh, easily to be perceived, you know, so... Hopefully, guys, no tengamos ninguna emergencia soon, but anyways, we gotta be ready. So uh, we're going to get started today, uh, checking a couple of thingies. Uh, revisamos también passive voice. And guys, recordemos que para mañana 
debemos de dejar ya completada la plataforma, right? So, si alguien todavía está stuck, ajá, o todavía le faltan ejercicios, guys, um, so, please, no se les olvide ponerse al día con ellos. Probably not easy to forget, pero siempre se nos va y like, ay, lo hago mañana. <laughs> Or in good Salvadorian lo procrastinamos, right? So we procrastinate a lot. So um, intentamos terminarle, right? Recordemos que arriba de ocho ya es una passing score, más lo que sumamos de asistencia eh, para pasar el módulo. So let me get started, guys. And let me present here a couple of activities we got for today. And I want to get started, guys, with a little trivia. So, but it's very fácil. It's pretty easy, I would say. So here we have like a little trivia. It is about general thingies. Uh, so I have, for example, um, some questions like, what is important about your country? Guys, um, do you have an idea of the products that are imported by El Salvador? What are some products that are imported? Tamales y pupusas. Imported, like, 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 bro, or exported. Everything, everything. Like uh, the wear, the shoes. Oh, okay. Yeah, remember the that footwear. imported is like from other countries to El Salvador, and exported is from El Salvador to the world. <laughs> like, uh, lo que dice el King Flip, right? The El Salvador para el mundo, I think, the Morazán para el mundo, I'm not sure. So that is exported, but in this case, uh, imported, right? El Salvador para el mundo, papá. El Salvador del mundo, right? <laughs> yeah, I kind of remember. So uh, you said shoes, okay, footwear. ¿Qué más, guys? What is imported? Electronics, anything else? Electronic, Italian, mm -hmm. eh, este, tecnología, como se dice tecnología. Ah. Yeah, technology, technology. O, o si son, Ajá, los, ten, si son las cosas. Tecnología. Los objetos que dice electronics. Fertilizer. Technology, electronics. I'm sorry, Boris. Fertilizers. Ten, Fertilizers, uh -huh. probably. Okay. Guys, sí, ¿alguna vez han importado algo? Have you ever imported anything? Um, <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, a gadget. The for gadgets. My phone. Okay, so gadgets, cars, uh, store parts, right? Um, for your car, motorcycle, etc. So those are the most common. Now, what is exported? Alguien dijo tamales, so probably tamales, pupusas. Do we export anything else? Do you have any idea? We export too much uh, uh, wears, ropa. Oh, okay, clothing. So we export clothing. Clothing, clothing. Oh, Sorry. okay. And we export oh, no worries. Mm -hmm. Sugar. Sugar, okay. So yes. I didn't know we exported sugar. So we export sugar, clothing. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué más exportamos, guys? What do we export? Coffee. We export uh, carton. Okay, carton. Creo que escuché. I'm not sure if that was Helen, but se le quebró un poco. Coffee. Co oh, coffee. Okay. We export coffee. All right. Teach. Teach. Uh, t shirts, like camisetas. T shirts. Sugar. 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 Well, somebody said that we normally export sugar. I don't really know that. So maybe Can you can give us some info. Caña okay. de sugar. Sugar cane. No, but creería que es la azúcar ya procesada, right? So we export sí. sugar, not the sugar cane. Guys, eh, alguien trabaja en una empresa exportadora. Solo recuerdo Mauricio is a shipping company. Uh, alguien más? Anybody else? Nobody. Okay. Hi, Andre. Good evening. Hi, Hi. Good evening. Great cacao. to see you. Cacao. Okay. Or chocolate, right? So like so chocolate, chocolate powder. Chocolate. Mm -hmm. chocolate. Okay. Hi, Rafa. Andre. Good evening. Okay. okay. Good evening. That can work. All right. What about the next one, guys? What do you think is the most, uh, let me see. What do you think is the most popular luxury item in your, in your country? Who is it made by? Do we have any luxurious item? 
What is a luxurious item, guys? Luxurious Sorry, is like super fancy, right? Super expensive. Like everybody's like, wow, you have money. <laughs> so what is a luxurious item? Item. What is it? Suspiro. <laughs> what, what was that? Compañero, repita. I I'm sorry. I didn't get the word. No logré entender what was it. Solo escuché suspiro, I think. But I don't think that was the word. <laughs> ah, los suspiro, this is. No, Perfect. right? That was not the word. So, do we have any but luxury not fancy. item? Uh -huh, fancy, luxurious. Guys, ¿qué es algo que consideran luxurious or luxury item? Algo de lujo, right? Something luxurious. That we explore. Bon, bon, bon. Mm. No, no, no. Well, probably that can be imported or simply something that okay. is so, super popular the, in the country. The thing that we import could be cars and motorcycles. Car, cars, motorcycles. Okay. Well, de hecho, importamos Normal. casi todo. So everything is imported, right? Most of the things are imported. About uh, fancy. Mm -hmm, something fancy that is imported. Cars, so motorcycles. Socks. Socks. Two we import in trucks. Rocks. Luxurious. Do we? Trucks. Trucks. Oh, okay. Okay. So probably some trucks, some cars. Okay. That could definitely be. Uh and Plata then we night. have the next... Plantain. And then we have the other one that is who is it made by? But uh, creo que no hay muchos Ferraris, for example, right? There are no like super uh, fancy cars, are they? Not really not. Guys, I've been so um, fancy cars here, like super, super fancy, super expensive cars. In, in oh, Acajula, see. I see too much uh, Porsche. Okay, Porsche. But news. So, Tesla. Tesla, really? Yeah, Here we, in the country? Yeah. yeah. Ah, the, where did you see a Tesla? Um, por donde trabajo, también en Santa Elena. Oh. Are sí, they? Solo es uno el que anda en el país, solo uno. Santa, Santa Elena hay un poco. But do they look good? Si se ven geniales, do they look good? Yes. Yes. So, so. Okay, Google. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. in Estados Unidos, si se miran más. O sea, yes. Si más. Pero aquí sí si solo uno. Pero. But in the country, uh -huh. I mean, no he visto todavía Tesla. I haven't seen any. Pero uh, sí, Santa Elena anda eso. Nice. Sounds sí. good. Okay. So, any other car that is fancy, guys? Creo que BMC más, más, right? So, we have BMW. Uh, ¿Qué más han visto, guys? What have you seen? I have never seen a Ferrari. Um, what have Corvette. you seen? Corvette. Creo que he visto one or two. No, I have San, seen. In Santa Austin. Elena. Ah, in Santa Elena. What have I you seen? seen Camaro. Santa Tecla. Oh, Camaros. Okay. Yeah, I think that they are a little bit more more come up, but I have never seen it like a Ferrari or McLaren. Oh, Audi, that's another one. And the motorcycles, guys, ¿cuáles son como las más luxurious? BMW. BMW, okay. That, that's it, right? Just BMW. Yes, because um, motorcycles. Yamahas. But the thing is that in El Salvador, Las calles creo que no ayuden. <laughs> I think that's the reason why we don't, we nobody buys expensive things. Okay, so not too many luxurious uh, items. Okay, next one, guys. Who are the best electronics made by? So if we are talking about electronics, who are the best electronics made by? What is the company? Is it Samsung? Apple. Apple, okay. What about I the rest? Like what would you say? 
I guess that the best is could be Samsung, definitely. Okay, Samsung to so Apple. Uh, yo me voy mucho because, con Sony. I go a lot with Sony too. Because Apple use use uh, make uh, cell phones or table tablets or mm -hmm. computers. So mm -hmm. Samsung or Sony could be do wherever. For example. Computer, cell phones, and mm -hmm. okay. cameras. cameras, yes. Well, cameras. In, in cameras, I think the best is Sony. So, because yes. in TV cameras, too. which one? In, in TVs. In TVs, right? Sony. Yeah, Sony is better. Oh, uh, and I think Sony. they have uh, in tablets. Um, washing machines, right? In lavadoras, they do have washing machines. I think. Creo que Samsung son los que tiene. Or Samsung. I have Sony, seen Sony Whirlpool, Samsung, but I don't know Mave, Sony. Mave. Um, but that is more in, um, like in stoves, right? In a fridge, I think. Okay, okay. So, but yes, they definitely fit in here. Uh, next one, guys. Who are your favorite movies made by? No sé si saben de directores. So, who are your favorite movies made by or acted by? So, who are your best actors? Who are the best? Who are your favorite movies acted by? Let's change it for acted. So, acted by. Who is your favorite actor or actress, guys? Sandler. Oh, so when that's do, comedy. When, when, when do a movie? Nor a comedy. Oh, okay. So Adam Sandler. What about the rest, guys? Who is your favorite? Maybe Emilia Clark, Keanu Reeves. Um... E Emilia is from Game of Thrones, right? Yes. Oh, she's the a mother really of good dragon. One. Yes. Have you seen it? Yes. Yeah, that's right. What is the name of the actor, the, the tall guy that appears in, in Game of Thrones? Um, mountain. 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 No. Um, the, 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 the guy who is married to her in the story. Um, it's tall. Oh my God, I have forgotten. He appears in yeah, that one, that one. So he's a good actor too, right? So I think that he's a good one. Anybody else? Rafa, who who are your favorite movies cited by? <sighs> Teacher, I, I watch a lot of movies. Okay. But uh, I don't remember actors. And oh. the moment I like the movie, uh, a few two hours, I don't remember actors. Oh, but for example, if you're talking about like movies and the person who acted in the movie, uh, so what is your favorite? What is the movie you remember? Are, are you into comedy? Are you into romance, horror? What kind of movies do you prefer? Uh, I don't remember teacher more. <laughs> That's all right. No, That's okay. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. DiCaprio, for example. Uh -huh, like the, the, the most famous, right? DiCaprio. <laughs> And uh, this guy, Schwarzenegger, and uh, Stallone. Scarlett Johansson. Ah, it's Scarlett, talking about actresses. Guys, my favorite movies um, are any movie that are made by, um, what is the name of this guy? Jason Statham. I don't know if you have seen him. Like, the Transporter, Fast and Furious, uh -huh, Parker. So they are like super cool. Jurassic Park. Oh, Jurassic Park. Well, but 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 Whoa. what about the actors? Porque han habido muchas. There have been a lot. And guys, the other actor I really like is this man. Um, I don't know his name, but he is old. He has gray hair. 
He's very so, tall. And in one movie, um, he has a daughter and the daughter is taken the away. Remoto. The remoto. I don't remember yeah, his name. De Niro? This De Niro. one. Yes, De Niro. Leon, right? Leon? Leon Nielsen. Thank you. That, that, that is the one. He's super yeah. good. He's La a really good actor. San Andres. La Falla de San Andres. Oh, but that is with The Rock, right? So that is with The Rock, as well as Fast and Furious. Roca. Mm -hmm. Roca. No, he has good movies too. Okay. He has really good ones. All right, guys. What about number six? Who are the worst cars made by? Who do you think? Suzuki. Suzuki, no, definitely. Oh, really? Suzuki? <laughs> definitely. Okay. Oh. What do you think, guys? Who are the worst cars made by? Chevrolet. Chev, okay. Chevrolet? Oh, sorry. Ford. Nissan. Ford. Oh, Ford. Nissan. Okay. Este. Pointer. 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 What is that one? Creería que ese es el modelo, Honda. right? Honda. But Honda are. I think that Hondas Toyota. are good. As well as Toyotas. Uh -huh, Toyota. Sure. But the worst. Las peores. The worst. Este, y como se llama? Guys, have Merce you ever? Mercedes Benz, Mercedes Benz. La peor, the worst. Mm -hmm. Why? Porque es la peor, why is it the worst? Por marca de cars. Okay, but why? Por el precio, because of the, I don't know. Precio, calidad y, y mejor marca. Mercedes, guys, what do you think? ¿Alguna vez han escuchado de Chevy or Cherry Cuckoo? Something Chevrolet. like that. Chevrolet. It's bad too. Okay. Have you ever driven that car? What do you think about it? Hi, Margarita, tell me. Is it bad? Yeah. Okay. But Chevy, right? Or Chetty? Cherry. I don't remember. Okay. Chevy. 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 Chevrolet. Is it Chevrolet? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I thought it was something different. Yeah, because Cherry is something like that. I don't remember. Okay. Okay, guys. So if you take a look here, we have un poquito de passive voice. So... Uh, we have the rest like who wrote your um, favorite book. Oh, so we can transform it to um, it was written by, right? Or it is played. So for example, guys, number eight says what cell phone game is played most in your country? Guys, what do you think? Which is the most played cell phone game in El Salvador? Free Fire. Free Fire, Free Fire. is Free Fire. it? Yes. The Do you fire. play it? No. Do you play it? Have yeah. you ever played it? Clash of Clans. Clash of Clans. Okay. Clash of Clans is better. Yes, I play. Clash of Clans. Yes. Oh. I like. I like is this, this is game. Do you like? Perdón. Is it still alive? I mean, like available. Is it available? Is it alive? Mauricio is asking. Yeah. Oh, I don't do you, understand. Like alive, the vivo. Si todavía existe. Does it exist? Yes. Oh, okay. So is it alive? Oh, very interesting. I never played Clash of Clans, but so I remember you make groups, right? Yes, clans. Clans. Oh, but with different people, or or how is it? You can show your partners, your your friends. So with your friends, you made your you clan. Go, uh, yes, or, or with other person. But if you want with your yeah. friends, uh, I think so they have. Have to build a city, And then what do you do? Atacar otros clanes. In English. <laughs> okay, so you attack other clans. Okay, okay. The, ob the objective is rob the 
Ay, gold. Aldea, ¿cómo se dice? Gold of the... Village. Clash. Like. Aldea. A villages or village. 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 Mm -hmm. So you rob, but what do you rob? Like coins? Gold. Okay, you, gold. you rob gold. Elixir. Oh, okay. And you get and points. No, you get all that you rob. Oh. And you can use for you. Okay. So with the gold and everything that you rob, you can make your, I don't know, your Yours. plan bigger? No. Yeah. Your village. Oh, your village gets bigger. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I have never played that, but sounds quite good. Better than uh, Free Fire. <laughs> so definitely. Free, is, definitely. Free Fire is addictive, guys. So don't play it. <laughs> okay. So. Good evening. Simple. Hi. Good evening, Carlos. How you doing? Hello, Don Carlos. Fine. Thanks. How are you today? Uh, doing great at things so it's nice to hear you hi kenya good oh, evening yeah, yeah. so That's i'm glad too. how is your dad is he better uh, surviving <laughs> but you're yeah. not like taking care of him this week no yeah my brother is here now uh, okay He's with okay. him oh okay but that's yeah. but that's good that but you can i know he's still calling him um, no, but it's Plus, important. Uh, in, in, in the rest of the day, he is alone in the house. Oh. Well, but the good thing is that you can rely on each other, right? Yeah. So you support but, each other. But he, he's no, he don't want to go out still. He says he's going to take care of the dogs. He's taking care oh. of the children. They so have. He walks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but that's good. So he is still active. So. That, yeah, that is le cuesta, le cuesta bastante porque tiene un problema en la columna también, tiene unas hernias y tiene, le ha repercutido en el nervio ciático, entonces Ay. por eso es que lo estaba cuidando, le tenía que estar poniendo inyecciones ahí continuamente para el dolor y todo eso, y para mm. los nervios. Yeah, but, but, vamos, but, primero Dios, que Diosito me le dé fuerzas. Yes, I know, I know. It reminds me a lot of my dad, but... Um, but yeah, you know, so they are super stubborn. So lo, los señores just are like, I want to sí, go yeah. out. <laughs> but it's good because they are active. Yeah. No, anyways. él no quiere. Él no oh, quiere. he doesn't want to. Oh. Me lo quería llevar hoy a trabajar porque yo iba para la zona de La Paz, a Catecoluca y todo eso. Y le dije, pero no, me, me voy a quedar cuidando a los perritos mejor. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, he's busy then. Yeah. So that's good. Uh -huh. All right. All right. Yeah. Uh, give me just a second, guys. Glad Thanks. to hear that. And um, so, guys, we're going to be like going over uh, some risk ideas here. Uh, first of all, let's go ahead and check some vocabulary. Then we'll go for some readings. And then we have some speaking practice on, uh, on some natural disasters. So help me out with this little part. Uh, vamos a revisar, guys, some vocabulary here. Uh, and it says vocabulary match the words and phrases that describe effects caused by hazards and risks to the definition. Guys, so let me a little reminder. Uh, what was hazard? What was a risk? Do you remember? Amenaza, hazard. Okay, yeah, exactly. Risk. Yeah. So risk, okay, very good. We have some words like contamination. Let's be super super honest. This word contamination no is muy usada. Normally we use the word pollution, but sounds good. So contamination or pollution. Creería que van a ver más la palabra pollution. A casualties. Why readers? I have a sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry, Belen. Yes, it's the same or has a difference? No, no, no. It is exactly the same, but the word contamination, I'm super honest. Uh, he visto muy pocas veces. I have seen it just a couple of times. So normally, sí es más común pollution. Mm -hmm. Pero es lo mismo. It's exactly the same. So I would say contamination, pollution, it's the same. We have casualties. Uh, be careful. No es casualidad. So casualty is something super different. Property damage, loss of customers, 
financial loss, business interruption. Um, so help me with the definition, the meaning of these words. For example, machines often break down. What do you think this is? Um, property damage. Okay, so property damage, very nice. Company loses money. This is very easy, I think. Boss, boss is interruption. Uh, oh, okay. Financial, financial loss. loss. Yes, there you go. Okay, especially because you have the word lose and you have the word loss. Mm -hmm. So financial loss. Customer switch to another business or another provider. Lots of customers. customers. Oh, lots of customers. Okay, there we go. What about number next? Employee dies in an accident operating a machine. Low. Business customer. interruption. Business no. interruption. Mm. No, it could be. Oh my God. Employee dies. Property time. Casualty. Ca cas oh, yes, that's the one. Casualty. Exactly. Casualty. Casual. Uh -huh. So a casualty, guys, is employee dies in an accident. What is that? What is a casualty then? If you die in an accident. De trabajo. Mm, yes, but how do you call the person? For example, Contamin Contamin. Mm -hmm. so for example, if you are, I don't know, in a car accident, in a fire, in an earthquake, and it says, oh, are they casualties? So what would be casualties? Casualidad. <laughs> no, it's not a casualidad. <laughs> Se parece, but no. What do you understand then by casualty? Employee dies in an accident operating a machine. So what is a casualty? Uh, in películas, guys, think about movies. When you see a movie, especially Fast and Furious, there are a lot of accidents and they are, there are casualties. So it is. I give up it. In Spanish, como le llamamos? How do you I'm call it? Blind. <laughs> You're something blind. that that's suddenly happened. Uh, which one? Something that happens like a, suddenly. Yes, like a tragedy. Yes, it is something that can happen. Uh, yes, it could be. Normally, uh, es lo que les llamamos como víctimas. You know, in English, victims uh, es una víctima pero sin muerte. Casualty es una víctima que murió. You know. So that is a casualty. Se parece casualidad, but it is not. Yes. Yeah, uh -huh. exactly. Lo puesto a ileso, right? So uh -huh. ileso is a person who doesn't suffer any damage. A leso. casualty died. So that is the point. So cuando vean películas and you hear no casualties, oh, no vieron muertos. Okay, so they are not uh, dead people. That is the one. So let's move on with the next one. Production stops. What's this? Very good. Hey. Business interruption. Nice. And the last one waste residues that are handled improperly one. scattered to other areas. Exactly. Contamination or pollution. Okay. Good. Guys, can you give us an example of pollution in El Salvador? Too much. The trash the smoke that of people the cars. who okay smoke the mugs. okay trash yes normally we call it smog um sorry this one okay so smog a uh, trash what else noise pollution guys <laughs> Uh, imagine, imagínense si vivieran very close to Metro Centro. So, can you imagine the noise? So, like noise pollution? Yeah, so it's super noisy. Um, and then we have casualties, but we won't go there. Sorry about that. Okay. So having these words into account, let's go to the conversation that we have in the, our unit number four, 
and that is related to risk assessment. So take a look at this one. We have Gladys, we have Miguel. Let me see, I came to school for a couple of days. Uh, uh, um, uh, Angelica, are you good? Is your voice better? Yes, better. Oh, nice, yes. <laughs> ya le escuché. <laughs> okay, good. Can you help us with Gladys, please? And okay. uh, let me Miguel, see. Miguel, Miguel. You want to read, Miguel? Okay, yes, please. <clears throat> okay. I'm glad we are over with the risk assessment process and the safety measures manual. Mm -hmm. According a gray more recycling, recycling, I watching, I want needs about what of hot competitors, competitors. Mm -hmm. They were a few because, should mm -hmm. because of and project I did win manipulating, marrying. She mm -hmm. have it, have it, machinery. 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 Okay, thank you so much. Why? That's such bad news and very bad publicity for the company. She a lot, a lot bad publicity. A child have negative. If I mean, I buy it that way, a lot of customers. A loss of our force eh, is organization and eventually finish, eventually, financial locks. Financial, financial, financial locks. Okay, totally. I'm so relieved we're done with the safety measures manual. Now we want to plan its implementation to reduce accident as much as possible. Thank you very much. Yes. And yes. That's it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Okay, guys, very nice job. So let's take a look at a couple of words. Um, the most important we have here is they were sued, right? They were sued. It says, recently, I watched some news about one of sure, our competitors. Uh, competitors, they were sued. So guys, what is the meaning of this word? Sue, Demand? not the person. Demanda? Yes, exactly. So they were sued. That means like ellos fueron demandados. Uh, the word demanded in English is muy diferente a uh, un juicio, right? So they were sued. Or I was sued. Or I sue someone. That is like another way we normally use it. So. I sued, right, someone or a company, so yo los demande, right? Uh, then we have the other one, I'm so relieved we are done. I'm so relieved. What is relieved? So we have Gladys and Gladys says, I'm so relieved we are done with the safety measures. I'm so relieved. What is that? Yes, exactly. So I am relieved. Normally we use this expression, right? Like, oh, okay, Livio, I'm so relieved. Yeah, so, or we can also use the one that is, it is a relief. So it's an alivio, right? It is a relief. So it's la misma palabra, but we use it in different contexts. I am so relieved. Yo me siento aliviada, right? Hello, Iris, great to see you. And it is a relief. Uh, I'm sorry, it is a relief. So, es un alivio. Um, so, and the other one we use is I sued somebody. So, yo demande, right? Um, let's keep this in mind because we are going to be using some of this expression. Guys, is there any other word that you don't know from the text? I'm not you... sure about the loss of trust. Trust is like confianza. Yes, exactly. Oh, uh, in English we have the word uh, lose, right? Como yo pierdo algo or the past that is lost. 
I lost money, I lost my wallet, I lost a bet, etc. But tenemos también la palabra lost. So lose, lost, loss. But loss is pérdida. So uh, if I want to say, oh, la pérdida de cabello, for example, the loss of hair or the hair loss. The loss of hair or hair loss. So, si acá tengo, like, the loss of trust, so that would be that idea, right? So, ya no confío en alguien, he perdido. So, this is pérdida. Uh, they are super similar, but pronunciation changes a little bit. This is lose, this is lost, and this is loss. So, very similar, but yes, this is pérdida. So, loss of, for example, I don't know, Pérdida de, de dinero, so loss of, loss of money, loss of funds, pérdida de, I don't know, parientes, por ejemplo, so loss of relatives, relatives son como familiares, right? Loss of relatives, loss, loss of family members, etc. So that's the one. Any other guys? Teacher, maybe... Um, I have two words that I don't know how how to uh, como decirlas. Okay, okay. Tell me which one. Um, the first one is assess assessment. The risk assessment. That's perfect. Okay, and the second one is uh, in Miguel, and the last uh, sentence have heavy. Um, heavy machinery, mach machinery, ah, this one, eso. Uh -huh. ha have a... actually, creería que hay un error de spelling here, un error de error, because it's supposed to be heavy, but it says have, so yeah, heavy is with y, but, yes, right? yes, 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 you're ready about that. It should be heavy, creería que es más un error de dedo, you know, so. Yeah, because have no tiene, no tiene, mm, no tiene que andar haciendo ahí. <laughs> so yeah, I, I would say that is a uh, um, typo, sir. We're manipulating heavy machinery. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that would be heavy. Um, I'm sorry, Iris. Ya no le contesté, but yes, no worries. Gracias, miss. Thank you so much for that. Um, okay, guys. So I think we're good. Very nice. Uh, keep this in mind because las vamos a utilizar in a couple of minutes. But in the meantime, guys, vamos a hablar un poquito. We're going to move a little bit and talk about these disasters. So give me just a moment. So estamos hablando de pollution, contamination, casualty, damage, loss, uh, financial loss, business interruption, etc., etc. And if what happens if we start talking about races and hazards, pero cuando hablamos de esto, guys, de some natural disasters. First, uh, what are the natural disasters that we suffer in El Salvador? Um, la nieve, ¿cómo se llama? Ah, winters. snow. Ok, winter, snow. aunque snow en realidad no, todavía no, right? Nuestro clima no, no da, but winter, yes. Earthquake. Earthquakes, yes. ¿Sí? I'm sorry, what was that? Winds. Tremors. Tremors, earthquakes. Yeah, mm -hmm. winds, yes, como heavy winds or strong winds, vientos muy fuertes, so strong winds. What else? Uh, okay. Hurricanes, okay. We strong never winds. had those. Mm, I don't think so. Creo que los volcanes no permiten, you know, en, en nuestra... Um... Va de retro, Satanás, Liz. <laughs> no, I think that, creo que es la, how do you call it, guys? Um... No es la infraestructura. Ok, so volcanoes, hills, and all of that. Creo que no lo permiten. Um, what else? El cinturón de fuego que le mienta. ¿Rafa? 
How do you say deslizamiento? Ah, landslides, like in Santa landslides. Tecla, right? That was so bad. So landslides. Mm -hmm. You said hurricanes, ah, uh, floatings, okay. Floatings. So floatings, de hecho ahorita, I, I don't know if today or yesterday, um, estaban llamando como a mantener un, un uh, precaución con las floatings, right? Porque había mucha lluvia. Um, what else, guys? No more? Well, we have pollution. Fires. Well, ahorita como estamos in winter is not very common, but fires is super common um, during um, summer, right? Summer times. Anything else, guys? Tornadoes? No? And tsunamis? No, tsunamis, no, but uh, big waves. Yes, big waves. Okay. Guys, recuerden. Ah, granizo, hailing. Recuerdense todas las películas you have seen. <laughs> okay. So the day after tomorrow. Overflow. Overflow. Yes, yes. Cyclones. Yeah, cyclones or typhoons. Uh huh. Well, we have like a lot of those things. So we're going to go over. I love this game. Okay. So I have here like some natural disasters and I have races. Okay. And here, guys, tenemos la descripción. We have the description. Uh, I'm sorry. Olvide escribir. I forgot to write. This is a cross. Um, Creo que sí. <laughs> I don't remember very well, but we're gonna go over this. Uh, and this is down, okay. So this is a cross and down. So um, we have the description guys, and we're going to try to put it into these um, spaces in the crossword. So uh, para hacerlo guys a little bit, you know, easier, faster, more practical, Recuerden que ustedes en su teléfono o en your computer tienen la opción de habilitar sus notas. So, váyanse al menú, please. Go to your menu. Uh, váyanse donde dice, um, ya les digo cómo les aparece. Pizarra, teacher. Les aparece pizarra. No, no, no. Les aparece eh, anotar oh, o oh, anotaciones oh, oh, oh. o en el teléfono les aparece un lápiz. Table. Mm, and no, anotar les aparece or notes, se está en inglés. Pen. And, Ma then, and then vamos a seleccionar la T de texto. You're going to select the T and then ya pueden escribir dentro de este crossword. So, si ya tienen la palabra, if you got the word, you can help us here. Um, for example, we have a very strong wind in West Atlantic. So, como le llamamos eso? How do you call that? A tidal wave. ¿Cómo se les llama a las waves, right? A las olas, pero muy grandes. Like super, super, super big. How do you call them? Across, tenemos one. We have number three. We have number six. A, a very bad event causing harm or death. ¿Cómo le llamamos a eso que es muy malo? So, something that is super bad. Uh, move someone from a dangerous place. What would it be? A long period without rain. Les voy a ayudar con la número nueve. I'm going to help you with number nine. Because esa es la sequía. So that is D. Um, R. O. Wait. What am I writing? O. Uh, U. G. H. And T. So that is called a drought. So that is what we call a sequia, right? Um, then down we have a sudden movement or in the ground. Guys, ¿cómo le llamamos a eso? How do you call that? A sudden violent movement. Cuando se mueve la tierra. What is that? Number three. Earthquake. Ah, okay. There you go. So ayúdenme, please, with number two. A strong wind that blows in a circle. What is that? How do you call that? Hot liquid rock. ¿Cómo le llamamos a la piedra líquida? Oh, I think it's about a volcano. Le so how do you call that? Le 
A what is um, volcano? Of a volcano, it says. And number seven, to explode and throw out fire, lava, smoke, etc. ¿Cómo se le llama eso? How do you call that? Guys, I'll give you five minutes. Eh, si ya tiene la palabra, if you have it, you can use your dictionary. And ayúdenme escribiendo la acá, please. Help me out writing them uh, here. Guys, ¿todos encontraron la opción de anotar? Did you find it? Yes, I think you can. Oh, okay, perfect. Yeah, está en su menú, está en la parte de abajo. Dice anotar o un lápiz, right? And uh, luego le damos seleccionar texto o la T que les sure, aparece. So you can write. Me, mm -hmm. For me, use a peer or pencil. Oh, y les aparece la T. And you see T after that. No. No. Una flecha. Mm. In, my, in my cell phone. You are in your cell phone, right? Yes. Permítame, please. Déjenme entrar del teléfono. I'm not sure. Oh, ya vi a Rafa. Okay, nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Sorry, guys. The fish <laughs> number. <laughs> nice. Oh, this is not in your. This is not in your material. Nope. The, vocab oh, the vocabulary no está, pero es la actividad que we gotta do. Give me just a second. 